You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, Days of Our Lives fans. We have got a big comings and goings update for you that we couldn't wait until the end of the week because part of this is breaking news. We've got two big ins and one huge out from the NBC Peacock streaming soap opera. And these three huge cast changes are on top of all the guest appearances that we've also got from ancillary cast returning for Victor Kidiakis's funeral. We are going to dig in, tell you who's back, and most importantly, tell you who is out. But if you haven't already, please reach down, click subscribe so you don't miss any of our day's updates. So just to recap, who is coming for Victor's funeral? Right now, we've already gotten back Philip Kitiakis, Sonny Kitiakis, Sarah Horton, Rex Brady. We're about to have Chelsea Brady back. We already have Teresa Donovan back. And then by the end of this week, we are also going to have Vivian Alamein back too. Plus, we already leaked that Susan Banks is alive, so I expect to see her soon. But none of these people are the three that we are talking about and the reason that we have this breaking news for you. First, let's dig into the two returning actors. Soon after Victor's funeral, Alex Kidiakis and Brady Black take off for Greece, reportedly to investigate some claims raised by Vivian Alamein when she swoops into Salem, crowing about Victor being the love of her life. So the two that are coming back are John Black's son, Paul Narita, and his boyfriend, Andrew Donovan. Both are back on the scene. Looks like they are going to be part of the Grease storyline. They are on a collision course with Alex and Brady. And guess who is going to follow the Salem twosome to Greece? It is going to be Teresa Donovan, Andrew's sister. It has been since March 2023 that we last saw Paul and Andrew, but both of them are back and they are helping find answers in Greece. They are going to meet Alex and Brady there around September 15th. We have spoilers about Alex and Brady leaving town on the 14th and then them in Greece finding something shocking a week from this Friday, which is the 15th. So watch for Colton Little and Christopher Sean to be back on your screen in less than 10 days. So another critical tidbit about Teresa Donovan following them to Greece is that reportedly it is going to be on an airline flight that they make the change from Jen Lilly to Emily O'Brien playing the role of Teresa. I assume that she's going to leave Salem as Jen Lilly and touch down in Greece as recast Emily O'Brien in a wig and with her natural British accent completely muted to an American accent. There is no official confirmation on the day of the swap yet, but that's my feeling is that that's the flight it's going to be. It could be the flight bringing her back home to Salem. Who knows? But now it's the big item about who is leaving Days of Our Lives unless we are misreading a comment on social media. So we're going to tell you about it and then we're going to show you. There's an actress we're currently seeing on air right now on Days of Our Lives. And she posted a photo on Instagram. And then another actress actress from Days commented that she wishes they could have stayed at the soap opera. All right. So the actress that seems to have been written out is Akitra Civilian, who plays Talia Hunter, Jada's little sister, she of the drugged biscuit that made half of Salem very horny. You'll remember Talia came to town to torment Paulina Price on behalf of her boyfriend, Colin, and she helped was helping to destroy Paulina's life and Chanel Dupree's life, but now she's trying to get into Chanel's pants and have a romance with her. Also, Talia is back to working at the hospital as a doctor. Rumor has it her sister Jada winds up shot when EJ is waving a gun around at Bayview. And no, I'm not talking about what we saw this week. So please don't come in the comments and say it wasn't AJ. It was a hired gun. Spoilers for next week. The week of the 11th are when there is a shooting at Bayview. And then it's going to be EJ. Okay. So this hit woman failed. That's not going to be EJ's last try. Far from it. 
So they say that Jada is shot by EJ and that Talia is on hand as part of her sister's team treating her gunshot wound at the hospital. And then there's also chatter that their mother could come to town in the aftermath of Jada's shooting. So maybe Talia leaves town with their mother because also the week of September 11th, Chanel tells Johnny she's ready to commit and it sounds like to him and not to the woman who nearly ruined her life. So why do we think Talia's leaving? I'm going to tell you, I'm going to show you, and then you can see it for yourself. But first, please click like if you're enjoying this Days of Our Lives casting update. Definitely comment on who you're excited to see in town of all the people rushing into Salem right now. And also, please click subscribe if you haven't already. So... A Keetra civilian made this Instagram post about stuff she's been doing lately. She posted it on August 28th. Two days later, Ariane Zucker, who plays Nicole Walker, had some interesting things to say when she commented on that post. We're going to show you the Instagram post and the comments so you can see it for yourself. By the way, that is definitely Ari who commented. So don't come in and say, oh, that's probably not her. See the little blue check mark? That means it is confirmed. It is definitely Ari Zucker who commented. She said, why you are still not on our show is beyond me. Three exclamation points. You are a beautiful light to bigger and better. That definitely sounds like Ari is saying that she misses Akitra and that Akitra is no longer on Days of Our Lives. So that makes me wonder if she was one of those seven actresses that were part of the alleged massive cutbacks that simultaneously only affected one male actor, but seven actresses. And that came out as part of the mess surrounding now fired Albert Alar. Let us know what you think below. Thank you so much for listening. This has been Belinda from Soap Dirt. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcasts, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. 